Emotions explode inside Baltimore City Public School headquarters at a meeting tonight as parents and teachers demand answers about widespread heating problems. WJZ is live outside City School headquarters. Kimberly Eaton was inside the packed room as tensions overflowed tonight. Kimberly? And Mary, the school board had to throw out its meeting agenda tonight after several outbursts, even some shouting matches. Families showing up here to demonstrate they are simply done waiting for answers about those ongoing heating problems inside Baltimore City Schools. Outrage over cold schools. He showed up. Showing fields and see my granddaughter at four years old go into a cold school and had to try to learn. Heated up inside Baltimore City Public Schools headquarters at the first school board meeting since near freezing temperatures inside classrooms forced citywide closures last week. Despite the CEO of schools trying to keep order, you will have your time to be outspoken. You will have your time to be angry. The board tossed out its Tuesday night agenda after frustrations overflowed inside a packed meeting room. Meetings are nice. Action is better. Giving parents like Kalila Harris a turn at the microphone. Because we can't wait for you to tell us what's going to happen any further because you all don't seem to have a level of urgency for our children. Six schools kept the doors locked Tuesday, still planked with the frozen pipes and broken heating systems that left students shivering in classrooms. The way that they handled this crisis was absolutely awful. Um, there's no way the schools should have stayed open in conditions like that. Monday, Governor Larry Hogan announced help in the form of two and a half million dollars to get heaters working. But families still want to know how those systems were neglected to the point of failure. I'm not going to blame it on the money. I'm not going to blame it on you all. I'm not going to blame it on the mayor, the governor. This has been going on for decades. And later on this month, school administrators will hold a special town hall just to talk about the heating issues. As of right now, that's scheduled for January 22nd. Reporting live in Baltimore tonight, I'm Kimberly Eaton for WJZ. Kimberly, thank you. The school will also have an online process where parents can submit comments and complaints.